Unveiling the world of barristers and advocates. Legal vocabulary made easy. Hello everyone. Welcome back to another exciting video on professional legal vocabulary. In today's session, we'll delve into the exciting world of barristers and advocates. By the end of this video, you'll be more confident in using these terms, understanding their roles, and differentiating between them. Let's start with the term barrister. Barristers are a type of lawyer found in many countries, including the United Kingdom, Australia, and some regions of Canada. They are known for their ability to represent clients in court. One key point to remember is that barristers are often specialists in certain areas of law, and they use this expertise to provide high-level legal advice and courtroom advocacy. Next, let's explore the term advocate. Advocates are similar to barristers in that they can represent clients in court. However, the term advocate is more widely used across various legal systems, including those in the United States, India, and South Africa. In some jurisdictions, the roles of barristers and advocates may overlap significantly, while in others, they may be more distinct. While both barristers and advocates work within the legal system and represent clients in court, there are key differences between these roles. The exact differences can depend on the jurisdiction, but typically, barristers have more restrictions on their practice. They often cannot be hired directly by clients and must be engaged through a solicitor. On the other hand, advocates often have a broader role and can deal directly with clients. Now, let's look at some examples of how to use these terms in a sentence. 1. The barrister made a persuasive argument in court, convincing the jury of his client's innocence. 2. I am working with an advocate to handle my legal case. She has been very thorough and helpful. Remember, the usage of these terms can vary depending on the context and geographical location. That brings us to the end of our exploration of the terms barrister and advocate. These terms may seem confusing at first, but with a little practice, you'll be using them like a pro. Remember, learning legal vocabulary can be a significant step in understanding and engaging with the professional world. Stay tuned for more exciting content on legal vocabulary. Keep learning, keep practicing, and I'll see you in the next video.